Albert, what have you made of the news this lunchtime? Michael Owen has announced his retirement from the end of the season. To be honest with you, I was expecting that because he said if I can't play you know, enough games, I'll have to retire at some stage. And um, every week I was waiting for his, to see his name in the, for, for Stoke, but you know, uh, I knew at some stage that he would take that decision this year. How would you sum up Michael's contribution to the game? Fantastic. Um, practically one goal every two games for the national team. Same for Liverpool. Uh, a tremendous record. I mean, a lot of trophy. And um, five clubs in his career. Uh, as a manager, I was blessed to have met him and to have him in my team because his suppliers like Jamie Carragher, Steven Gerrard, Gary McAllister, you never forget about those players. And also they make you win. Uh, Michael was, um, I mean, very much involved in all the trophy we won in one year, in one season. And even that year he won the, the best award that any footballer can dream of, which is a Ballon d'Or. And uh, I think that he was, he was a fantastic player. You know? He was clever, he was a very intelligent person. And uh, I remember the person as much as the player. He was uh, obviously extremely fast and quick, but good speed and can withstand the charges, I can tell you. How would you sum up his career when you look at the injuries as well he suffered? Yeah, people would think that he had a lot of injury, maybe because he overplayed when he was too young. I don't know. Uh, all I can say that uh, is a match winner. Uh, many games, sometimes we were one nil down, and he would just have this spark to overturn the game. Do you think he so did play too many games when he was younger? I don't know. He admitted that one day, and. Uh, I know that sometimes I would rest him and he would, didn't like that because he had this fire in his belly, you know, he's a great competitor. He was spectacular to see, to watch, you know, he could beat players, he could go fast and he had a, a fantastic skill in front of the goal. I mean, in that, in that category of skill, I mean, I, I've met only probably uh, uh, Robbie Fowler. Both were outstanding in front of the goal. What were your most memorable goals? Oh, definitely the FA Cup final because, and also for himself. I mean, never mind uh, taking part into a, uh, a final, but he won it on his own practically. I mean, I mean the team was with him, but we were one 0 down, and he scored two goals uh, at the end of the game. Could you ever see him get into coaching now? You talked about him as a person. Well, he's bright, clever enough to do that and also uh, he's always been a, a very uh, team thinking type of player. Um, like Steven Gerrard, Jimmy Carragher, they are very much team orientated. Gerard, thank you. Thank